If you haven't already, hit that like button and subscribe and turn on post notifications so you don't miss any of our future videos. Uh, Aloha, everybody. We are in the kitchen. We are very excited because what are we making? Uh, wait. <laughs> it's your favorite drink. It's your favorite drink. He's been asking for eggnog since March. And so now we're here showing you the very easiest, most delicious eggnog recipe. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna do one and a half cups of unsweetened almond milk. So it's not a super heavy drink, okay? If you want, you could sub half of it with heavy cream, but this is dairy free, which is really cool. So here, we want this to come to um, almost a boil uh, simmer. Kai, I need you to crack two eggs into this bowl. So let me beep, beep, beep. There we go. No, no, into that bowl. Okay. There you go. You crack two eggs into there. And I'm going to put um, a teaspoon of vanilla into the blender. I'm going to put a half a teaspoon of nutmeg into the blender. And I'm going to put three tablespoons of Swerve Confectioners into the blender. You could also use uh, vanilla stevia if you want to use that instead. We got a shell, that's why I said put it in the bowl first. <laughs> got to get that shell out. Okay, is it out? Yes. Now I'm going to put the two raw eggs into the blender, okay? So that is all set. This is still coming to a simmer, so we're just going to wait on that. I'm going to move this aside because Kai loves whipped cream. When he saw me bring out the whipped cream canister, he was like, whipped cream, whipped cream. All right, so what we're going to do is Kai's going to let mommy do it. Okay, excuse me, bud. So here we have our whipped cream canister, and I'm going to pour our organic whipping cream right on into there. I want to make it shake and make it. Shake it up, shake it up. Make that now. All right, that's still coming to a simmer. Um, we're going to use stevia glycerite. You could put swerve confectioners if there you want to, but it's just easier to squirt a little bit of that in there. A little bit goes a long way. You could use the vanilla stevia if you want. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Can't do that yet, bud. You have to put this on first. See, that's why you need mommy's help. Okay? And then you need, you got to pay attention. Then you need to put this on. Okay, this whipped cream canister is super fun. Oh, it's coming to a simmer now. And now you put this on and you can tighten it. And then you'll hear it. Oh, can I do it? It's a little tricky. Has to be just right. Now, now do it. There it is. There's the sound. Okay, so you can shake that up. And this is a boil. Okay, so I'm going to turn this off. And I'm going to turn my blender to low. you got to see it, though. All right, so this is going to be on low. All right? And I'm going to pour the hot mixture into it. And that hot mixture cooks the yolks enough so they're safe to drink. Let's get this out of the way. How about that? All right, we'll move this over here. And now we have a fun little glass for you, Mr. Kai. You could drink this whole thing. You have two eggs. It could be a great breakfast, right? Yeah. And it's going to be delicious. So now what we're going to do is pour the mixture into here, and it's nice and perfectly thick. It would be thicker if you used heavy cream, but now we're going to make it not dairy-free. Hold on. We need to test this, baby, because sometimes it's not as thick as we want it in the beginning, right? <laughs> Perfect. And so you top it with whipped cream. And then you need to sprinkle it with a little bit of nutmeg. No. No. Why not? That's what's in. It's nutmeg is what makes eggnog eggnog. And then there we go. It's easy eggnog. It's delicious. <laughs> what do you think? That's some good egg. That's some good stuff. What do you want to say? Uh, cook Ma with your kids. Make eggnog with your kids? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Mahalo, everyone. Uh -huh. Sharon is caring. Share this video with your 